everybody, this is Natalie with Oh Look How Cute. I hope everyone is doing well. Today I have another unboxing for you. I am so excited for this one. I found this one on eBay and I had to have it. I did have to pay shipping, which you all know I don't like to pay shipping, but for this cute thing, I had to. So I ended up paying $19 for it plus $5 shipping and I am thrilled with this so I'm okay with that um this is a diamond dots brand diamond painting looks like they've changed their packaging a bit this is one of their new designs it's Lulu Llama it says intermediate and you guys know that um Leisure Arts also has a diamond dots brand <clears throat> excuse me diamond painting that they're selling now and I can see that they're kind of going with that on which kits are beginner intermediate or advanced so this one is an intermediate it's the llama and this is what you actually diamond paint looks like it has a total of 15 colors and I like how they show how many actual diamonds are going to be on the canvas I think that's pretty cool um Sure beats having to add it all up with your calculator. So let's dig into this thing and see what we got. On the back of it, it shows, you know, how to diamond paint. It shows you what to do. Follow the diamond dots chart. Picking up is easy. Sticking down is fun. Quick and easy and fun to do, just use the diamond dot stylus to pick up a dot and place it onto the matching square on the sticky print. Pretty self-explanatory. I think we can figure this out. All right, so let's see here. I just got it in the mail today. Um, like I said, I did get this from a seller off of eBay and what a fantastic seller she was. She was so informative. She answered my questions in a very quick fashion. I was very impressed with her. I mean, I would send a message to her and ask her a question and she would respond quickly. I was very happy with her and I definitely will purchase more of these from her. There's a couple more I want to get. So I will definitely get them from her. Even though I have to pay shipping, it's worth it when you can get good quality and from somebody that actually cares about their customers. The box should say child proof or should I say adult proof because I can never get into these packages. All right. I'm so excited. All right. All right, so here's our canvas. And Diamond Dots has their special saying on it. Add some sparkle to your world. Let's see here. It comes with more detailed instructions in different languages. We've got English, French, Spanish, Dutch, Italian. So yeah, here's just kind of a quick rundown. All right, this is a partial round. Really nice canvas, nice and thick. Let me just roll it a little bit on the other side, see if I can get it to lay flat. You guys are probably cringing watching me do this. All right, I end up laying it under my mattress 
until I'm ready to work on it anyway, so it'll lay flat, but I just wanted you to be able to see it. It is Lulu Llama. Isn't she just darling? I am so in love with her. The background is really cute. It's pre-printed. So all you do is diamond paint the llama. As I mentioned, it has 15 colors. The design size is 32 by 42, but the fabric size is 40 by 50. So that helps you pick out a frame for it. So here's the thumbnail, and this is what you actually diamond paint. That's kind of not a very good picture to see exactly what you diamond paint, but it is the whole llama. The whole llama you diamond paint, just not this pink background. But you do its little body, neck, and everything. Really, really cute. I am so excited to do this. And I'm glad Diamond Dots is coming out with some new patterns. <clears throat> now let's just hope Michael will start Michaels will start to carry some of these um, newer patterns because I'm tired of seeing the old ones all the time. All right, let's take a look at these diamonds really quick. See if we have anything special in them. It does say on here, Lulu Llama. So me, I, if you guys saw my diamond drawer, you would freak out. It is so unorganized. But thank goodness for these decals because it helps me find what I need. And if they don't have them on there, I write them with a permanent marker. So there's no losing them. All right, so we got our normal tools. We've got the gray tray with the cutout. We got the clear sparkly pen with the grippy. I really like these grippies. I wish all of the diamond paintings came with them because they do get worn out. I don't know if you have if any of you have experienced them wearing out, but they do wear out. So it's nice to have these. In fact, I saw them on AliExpress, a set of 10, 10 of them for like $1.50. I'm going to definitely get them because I really like them. And then here's their little jar of wax that Diamond Dots is known for. It's a cute little jar. I save these jars and when the wax is gone, I just take the square wax that we have and I just use like a um, circle punch or even a cookie cutter and you can cut it down to any shape you want and I just do round so it will fit right into my jar. Love it, it has a lid on it so it keeps your wax nice and moist. All right, it also comes with baggies. These are the thicker baggies, but I don't use them. I would rather put them into my little jars or containers or thicker bags that I picked up at Michael's because these tear really easily. But they do come in handy for other things, so I do hang on to them. All right, so let's take a look at our diamonds and see what we have going on. Um, so it does look like Diamond Dots has come up with their own numbering system. They're not actual DMC numbers, but they're kind of like Diamond Dot DMC numbers, which I'm okay with because I have been purchasing a lot of Diamond Dots paintings and I will continue to do so. I have been really impressed with them and I just like I have been with Diamond Art Club, they have really good paintings and I am okay spending more money to get nice paintings. I'm so tired of not getting good stuff anymore from China. Not that I won't order from China anymore. I still have a lot in my cart but I think I'm gonna cut back on a little of the things and, and really get things I want. So we have, <clears throat> excuse me, we have some white and a peach color and tan. This is like a, a teal color. And then another blue color and a pink and a brighter pink and brown, darker brown, and some reds. 
Nothing special about those. We also have some orange, green. Oh, looks like we have a love affair going on at the Diamond Dots factory. A different shade of green and another shade of pink. It doesn't look like any of these are AB diamonds. However, it did come with some special gems. These are the red gems. I take it that's going to go around her neck right here. She's going to be so cute. I can't wait to start on her. But I have other things going on right now. I'm doing a Christmas present for my mom. It's a 60 by 80 desert scene. And I have a long ways to go. And Christmas is only a month and a half away. So I've been really busy trying to get that done, but I keep sneaking little diamond paintings in here and there. So yeah, haven't been very good at doing it, but let's hope I can get it done before Christmas. Um, as you know, I don't like to do stuff in a rush. I like to do it at my leisure. That's why it's a hobby. But my mom asked me to do that for her for Christmas and I'm happy to do that for her. So it looks like they did give me, <clears throat> excuse me, I guess I'm coming down with something. Um, they did give me some extra of these little red gems, so that's nice. I like when they give you a little bit extra of the special gems. You just never know what could happen to them. All right, so here is a copy of the key. So here's the serial number. There's the grid sign. And there's their diamond dots number. So now I'm going to have to come up with a different filing system for my diamond dots. Because like I said, I will continue to buy them as long as they keep coming out with new designs. I still want a few of their old designs, but their new designs are really neat. I'm very excited um, for the next couple that I want to get to show you guys. So yeah, just easy symbols to follow. These are the special gems right here. The drill filled, nice and sticky, never have a problem with them. Here are the symbols. That looks like a river, but it's not. It's just the way that the glue is. Yeah. So. I think that's going to be really easy to do and fun. It still will probably take a few days though, I bet, because it looks like a lot of confetti in there, um, which I'm fine with. I've come up with a new setup where I can sit on the couch or in my bed and do some smaller diamond paintings on a lap desk, and I'm really enjoying that. So when I get tired of working on the cactus and I just want something little to work on, something fun, so I feel accomplished, I get out my little lap desk and work on it. Otherwise, I sit at my table and work on the bigger ones. But there you have it. Lulu Llama. I absolutely love her. I hope you guys did too. So there you have it, my friends. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. And I'll see you in my next video.